What is up guys, how's it going? Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to do the Yetka's Dagger mission. Uh, so, starting off here, that was right after you leave the uh, monastery area, after you beat the first boss. You come out here and uh, I'm just showing you, you want to go up there, pull that lever, go to the side, pull this lever. Uh, there will be enemies obviously, but I have killed the enemies. Now if you've already beaten... Uh, if you've already made it to Yetka, then you guys can just skip this. I'll have an annotation probably before this and up to now. So you guys can skip straight to where you are at Yetka. There will be a monk here you can talk to. I might do his story thing later once I complete it. All of it. Um, so you just want to keep going down this way. Uh, you'll come to the circle area. There will be some more enemies, obviously. Um, right here, you will get your gauntlet and some stuff will happen. And then you'll fight some more enemies. And you'll come up here. That door right there will be closed. You will not be able to go there. But anyway, so you want to go to the left here, and Yetka will be right here. So you want to talk to her twice. Right, well, there's a check with her. You want to talk to her twice, and she'll talk to you about the dagger. I'm not going to do that. Also, that's the boss right there. But So you talk to her twice, and then you want to go this direction. There will be some enemies up here. At least one or something. I think two. And you want to come down into this area. There will be a guy who has this big axe or whatever right here and then you want to go down even farther and for me there was a spider uh and the spider is so hard to kill um so be careful about the spider okay uh right here there is a platform that you will need to drop to from before but the spider will be hard good luck uh this is playthrough too so it wasn't very hard for me actually but the spiders are my least favorite enemies in this entire game i hate them more than anything um so you want to come over here and slowly drop off the edge and there you'll be able to see it but they'll, there's going to be an item right here but I already picked it up obviously because um, I just did so you want to just slowly drop off of here make sure you don't actually fall and die but right here there will be a key it will be the tower key I will show it here uh, right here and that will allow you to get Yedka's dagger. So from here you want to jump down. You got to be careful not to fall off <coughs> the stage. That would be really annoying. So you want to come down here. There should be, uh, I think there's an enemy down here. Maybe a couple. You want to go here. And you'll want to open that door with the key, I this believe. This is my sixth night on And watch. there is obviously the an audio diary right there. The fires on the horizon burnt out. An all-encompassing silence has fallen. Maybe the Rogar have retreated. Right here, there is a chest. Uh, normally, there is an enemy right here. It'll be one of those axe guys. Be careful of the... Uh, I'll show you in a second. Right here, you get the fate axe. But right here, there is a gap. So be careful. You need to jump over that. I died the first time while I was fighting that guy. An accident, because I fell off. You, you want to go left first. Uh, there's going to be a couple enemies. A couple of those zombies, guys. And you need to jump right here. I almost died there, too. Uh, right here, I don't remember... Obviously, the video will show you what it is. Um, I believe it is a staff called Prejudice. So, so you want to come this way now. Go up this uh, staircase. And there will be some enemies in this room. Um, there's a chest right over to the right here. That contains the hot blood... Uh, like in wrist armor, light armor, and right here should be Yetka's dagger. Now, you can choose to keep the daggers for yourself. I don't think they're that great. They might be pretty good for a uh, first playthrough, I'm not sure. I will show you it here in a second. That's prejudice. Oh, uh, Yetka's dagger is right here. So. Normally it would deal more damage than what it deals right now because I don't have enough agility. But. It's still not that great. Um, I also show the fate axe here. I accidentally skipped it. But this axe is actually pretty good for if you were to get this before I like these types of weapons like the two hand weapons so if you were to get that uh, early enough then it would probably be really good if you had enough strength to wield it 
So then you want to use the tower key and come up here. Uh, the tower key, you keep it the whole time, and you can open this door. Uh, there's an enemy right here for some weird reason. Both times that I've recorded stuff, there's some random enemy that I find that I didn't kill. I don't get why. Uh, for the other one, I think I cut it out, though. But for this, I don't even care. Alright, so you can go back and talk to her. I'm not going to spoil the dialogue. Uh, but once you talk to her, I accidentally talked to her here. You get a key to the catacombs. Um, you will see in a second. I might have a video where that goes to later, but... If you guys enjoyed, please uh, rate, comment, subscribe, and that's about it. Hope you enjoyed. Peace.